Welcome back to the Morning Rush. It was a year ago today we found out we were getting Izzy, our puppy with a purpose, a little bit smaller than he is right now. Let's take a look back on our year with our puppy with a purpose. That's been our first year with Izzy, our puppy with a purpose. Lauren Cobb is here. Lauren, you have been taking care of Izzy for that year, maybe even a little bit more than that. What are some of your favorite moments with Izzy? So he has grown up so much. He's done an absolutely incredible. So another outing that we've been on is when we went to the Coca-Cola factory, okay. or World of Coke, sorry. Okay. I've always messed that up. That's okay. And he did incredible. Again, always ignoring all of the distractions around him. He's grown up so much. Of course, when he was an excited little puppy, he was distracted by pretty much everything because the whole world was so exciting and now he's doing amazing yeah. focusing on me as his handler and you, and you guys also took him to the Georgia Aquarium I would imagine that would be a little distracting oh absolutely <laughs> so of course all the fish all of the children all of the people walking around and he did so well focusing on me the whole time that's awesome now where are we with his training because he is a he's a young man right now so where are you with the training so he has several more months with me as his puppy raiser. We will continue to refine all of his manners, making sure that he's as well behaved in public as possible. And when he's around 18 months old, he'll go in for formal training to learn guide dog tasks. And talk a little bit about the mission for the Guide Dog Foundation. Yeah, so the Guide Dog Foundation trains dogs and places dogs for with people who are visually impaired or totally blind. And we are able to place all of our dogs with our handlers at no cost to the handler through the generous donations of all of our donors. And so our mission is to help everyone live without boundaries. Okay, well, fantastic. We sure hope Izzy can still visit every once in a while because <laughs> we're going to miss him.